project is coming from the uh, Target bullseye bins as well. And these are fantastic wood signs that have these really sweet leather handles at the top. And again, they're three bucks from Target. You can't go wrong. Perfect class project. I do want to take off the leather hardware essentially just so I don't get it all mucked up. But it's really easy to unscrew these. Just make sure that you store your screws in a safe spot. And if it just flat out scares you taking it off altogether, you can totally leave it intact. Just work carefully around it. Okay, so if you wanted to like do the sides, you could. I really like the neutral wood, so I'm gonna leave that be, but you can kind of clean this up and remove any and all of these little sticky boogery bits that are kind of left over. Um, we're gonna go ahead and use the Ho 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 Santa. And he's gonna fit perfectly here. I do just wanna try to make sure that I center him off as much as possible. is to add some sparkle to Santa's accessories. So he has this wonderful little rim to his cap as well as like around his coat and wrist edges. I'm going to use the Stampers Anonymous um, glitter tool which basically just kind of focuses the glitter on the specific area that you want it to be sprinkled into and you kind of just pump the lid and it comes out. I'm using an extra fine glitter, so it's got like a really nice and subtle look to it. And a lot of you guys won't necessarily have the glitter duster, but you can always use your regular um, glitter dispensers as well. They just make a little bit more of a mess, which it's no big deal if you're being really careful. Or if you have a glitter pan, those are always pretty handy too. I don't know about you guys, but I kind of miss Martha Stewart at Michael's. I haven't seen much of her stuff in years. And she always had the most fun glitters and paints, so. I miss them. All right, I'm just, like I said, hitting his coat, his wrists, and the rim of his hat. Glossy Accents is a fairly quick drying res um, glue, so it's kind of nice to use. It does occasionally get clogged though, so kind of always have a stainless steel pen ready to go to dislodge the head. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and sift that off and be right back. Our last little zhuzhing up is me using the uh, Uniball Signo in gold. It's just basically like a gold gel pen. So I'm gonna come over Ho 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 just to give it a bit more shiny pop. We already have the lovely little glittery elements and so the gold will give us just a smidge more pop. have it. You have your sweet little ornament shaped wood sign for the holidays. If you wanted to hang this on your wall, you could very easily just kind of screw in the hardware on the back. Otherwise, you can use some sort of a knob to sort of hang on the wall depending on what you guys have. So we have Ho 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 Santa with his pretty little glitter edged coat and accessories. And I hope you guys enjoyed this project. Mm -hmm.